In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to insert or remove cross sections from your OpenVSV fuselage model. So by selecting our fuselage component, we can come to the cross section tab, and now we can start to demonstrate how we can insert and remove these sections. Now, when you insert a section, what it's going to do is it's going to copy the section that you happen to have highlighted and place it halfway between that section and the following section. So let's demonstrate that. If we pick this first cross section, which happens to be a point, and insert, it copies that point, collapses everything back onto itself, and then continues on. Now notice that it also carried the skinning parameters. So if we go back to section 0 and then 1, both of those are set to 45 degrees. So you have to be careful whenever you insert or even copy cross section types that it's going to bring the skinning parameters along with it. Say we didn't mean to do that and we want to get rid of it, we can simply cut and it gets rid of it and it leaves these other two sections perfectly alone. Now you might notice that we have section 1 here and section 2 here, but there happens to be this black feature line in between those two. So let me show you what that is. If we deselect, that line remains. That is a feature line at the u equals 0.5 location along these splines that define the fuselage component. It's simply a visual artifact indicating where your u is at the halfway point along your surface. So that's not hurting anything, it's just a visual artifact. Let's come back to cross section 1 and demonstrate what happens if we insert again. Notice how it copied this section again and you can tell that it carried the cross-section parameters along with it. We have a zero, direct, uh, zero angle and then it's carried on. Now you can also copy sections. So let's say we want to copy cross-section 2 and paste it to 3. We simply click paste on cross-section 3 and we're carried directly over. But once again it's bringing all of the skinning parameters with it. So if you have gone in and say skinned a fuselage so that it fits, uh, say, a three-view drawing, for example, but you want to copy a cross-section type from one to another. If you copy it and paste it in another section, those skinning parameters will be overwritten. So that's how you can insert, cut, copy, and paste cross-sections in your fuselage model. We'll get into some more details about how to control some of the placement and rotation of these cross-sections in other videos.